While Manhattan has pastrami on rye, and Miami has the pressed Cuban, Long Island boasts an entirely different kind of sandwich. This is the Sazzini. We had no hours. We just unlocked the door and we stayed open until we had to lock the door. It was whenever we ran out of food. In 2017, residents of Merrick, New York bid farewell to one of the town's most beloved soup and sandwich joints, Super Fry. But two years later, in March 2019, Super Fry reopened its doors to a massive crowd of Long Islanders, each one eager to get their hands on the renowned Sazzini sandwich. So the landlord called me back and he said, hey, the town wants you back. It's like literally they're, they're like asking, where is Super Fry? So if I give you opportunity to come back, will you? And then I said to him, let me make a phone call. And that was to Ivan. And I said, if, if Ivan's with me and, we, and he wants to do it, we're in. I couldn't even order during the grand reopening. I just came to show my support and, and tell Ivan, I'll come back when it slows down one of these days, but it hasn't slowed down. <laughs> All right, you guys, so we're in Merrick, Long Island, and I'm standing in front of a local hotspot called Super Fry, and they're best known for their sanzini, which is a cross between a wrap and a sandwich, and it's made with chicken cutlets, bacon, and cheese. It looks so good, I can't wait to give it a try. So let's go check it out. The sanzini is the most popular of the rapinis, Super Fry's signature panini pressed wraps. Despite its simplicity, the Sazzini has reached a beloved status across Long Island. I know everyone loves the Sazzini, like everyone goes crazy for that. Definitely I recommend the Sazzini because I know it when they try it, I know they're going to come in back. Here's how they make it. First, a chicken breast cutlet is dredged in flour, beaten eggs, and seasoned breadcrumbs. Then deep fried until crispy and golden brown. The chicken cutlet is then chopped up into cubes and transferred to a tortilla for the rapini. The tortilla is topped with shredded mozzarella, bacon, the chopped up chicken cutlet, and a splash of Super Fry's secret Roscoe sauce before being wrapped up and placed under the panini press. Oh my god. Oh my god, that is so good. I think my favorite part of this wrap is a chicken cutlet by far. It is so flavorful, it is cooked so well. And the breading has a lot of seasoning in it and so each part has just a lot of flavor to it and you can tell that it's made, you know, by hand, it's made just in-house in the back. It's not one of those frozen, you know, packs of chicken cutlets, like this is fresh and you can really taste that and it's so delicious. As its name suggests, Super Fry is also well known for its homemade soups and hand cut french fries. It's neighborhood people who come every day, we know them every day, we know what they like, we know what they don't like. And it's vital and uh, it's reciprocated. They come and support us. Since Super Fry returned to Merrick earlier this year, locals are hopeful that it's here to stay. I mean, Merrick just loved having them back. Everybody seems to come here, everybody knows about it. You know, they recommend it to each other. So. That's why we're here. So because I grew up here, me, my brother, my sister, my father is still, he's 70 years old, he works here, and he's a Nassau County baseball coach across the road. Uh, he has ties, we have ties to this community that, that are you know, very deep, so I'm very proud of it. <laughs>